Folks, got a forearm video we're going to do. Um, got a triple triple view version and then the, just the standard view. Let me make sure we're centered good. I don't know if you guys can even see the device I'm using. So, uh, belt squat again. You could do this at Planet Fitness with a bench and this uh, straight bar. Um, so, I am lifting my, uh, putting my, propping my feet up and using my knees to give myself a good spot to rest this on. I'm not sure if the floor view is getting getting the action. Uh, let's uh, let's make some adjustments here. All right, folks, uh, starting over on the, the floor view. <laughs> uh, so, you know, I have all these different webcams, and trying to line up a good shot is not easy. So we kind of want to, we got to figure out how to do this. And, of course, this thing is not on here nice and tight. Um, so the, the cord itself will move the camera. All right, I think we're okay now. So we've got three cameras, basically from above, kind of from the side slash front, so like at 45 and then above, and then I've got a push of one. All right, so just doing working our forearms with the belt squat. I gotta tell you folks, I love this apparatus. Um, now, if uh, I start shrinking muscle-wise, we well, could probably blame this, but um, for right now, I think it could potentially help me bulk up just by hitting the muscles differently. Give me some variation. And just like the other time, I'm going to go up in two and a half pound increments. So, uh, very convenient with this thing. You know, some people have cable machines at the house. Um, you can slide the weights on. Probably from that aspect, it would work oh, excuse me. just as good. Wow, it's late here, folks. I did a bunch of driving today. Had to drive to Norfolk, Virginia. So it looks like the camera did move, unfortunately. Um, so we're gonna, gonna have to work on that. I just need a, a better mount. No matter what, there's always something that doesn't work right. So we are using this pretty cool mount from the this the wall that I can I could actually mount on a uh, on the ceiling if I wanted to, and we would be able to get uh, all kinds of different views from that aspect. Now it's obviously pretty high up. And you can see me pretty good. It's really hard, folks, to figure out, you know, what. With the three views, I could set this up where there's three scenes and just, you know, switch back and forth, right? Because you don't want your views in a video to get stale. Um, but is, you know, having three views really the way to do this? I don't know. I don't get no, no feedback from anybody. Um, I can't say the videos are, you know, getting tons of views. So, 
because of that. Uh, makes you wonder. But the reality is YouTube is, you know, viewers are going to flock to the attractive people or funny people. I've got a smaller, um, I was going to say genre, but grouping of people that uh, might want to follow my workouts. At least 839 people so far. Um, so we're, this is going to be a quick forearm exercise. We're just doing these two exercises. Uh, you know, previously I've shown how to do this with dumbbells. I've shown how to do it with a barbell. This is undoubtedly the best, my favorite. Sometimes we use the, uh, the Marcy, I call it the forearm blaster. Um, matter of fact, I guess I, I should do that in this video. We'll do it. Let's do a rotation. All right. We loosen this up. So we'll break this into the rotation. This will be the third exercise that we do. And this really feels like pumping this part of the forearm right here, folks. Which is kind of the same one you would hit if you do hammer curls. So don't forget your hammer curls when you're doing biceps. Too many of these ego lifters that I know are all about just curls. How much can they curl? They forget about the hammer. The hammer curl, which will work, you know, that meaty part of the forearm. Then fill the bicep out. Now, of course, uh, you know, genetics play a huge role in your biceps, right? I mean, let's face it, either you have them or you don't. Uh, you can only do so much. Now, people that, you know, do all the exercises, uh, including concentration curls, you know, they might get somewhere, right? Realistically, a lot of us can just hope to put size on not necessarily some awesome shape um, and obviously people that are using performance enhancing drugs are going to have some success where others are not all right so we did that so I'm going to do I'm going to do three rounds here three rounds to go a little bit more. Yeah, I'm not going to spend as much time daydreaming about the gym, what we're going to do. <laughs> I've made a disaster of the the other part of the gym oh my god I mean I had I took the shelves out moved them and then all the crap that was in there is basically sitting on cards on the floor I yeah yeah working project we're a working process at least I have a good idea though of you know, the crap I want to buy. I really, I probably need to get my cable, corner cable machine. I probably need 12 grand, or excuse me, 6 grand or so for that. 6 grand for a good Smith machine. Um, 2,800 a piece for both of my hammer strength uh, back exercise machines, plate loaded. That's, you know, is it a waste of money at that point, folks? I think if, unless I can get deals on this stuff, it's not gonna happen. Or unless I can justify, hey, I'm gonna train some people, make some money, and you know, how long does it take to, 
How many customers do you need? <laughs> How many sessions do you need? You know, <clears throat> quite a few to uh, get your money back on that. So probably not worth it. Um, the stuff I'm looking at. Now a Smith machine would be nice from the safety aspect of it. Um, a little more controlled. You can still get strong on them using those. You know, free weights, dumbbells are the best way to get stronger. All right, folks, we're almost done here. That was a quick, pretty much a quick forearm workout. Thing about this, folks, you got to stay consistent. Too many times I have not put the time in. And the reality is, you see in the other stuff, you know, putting the time in and it's paying off, so... We're gonna just keep keep at it. So I think I have a couple videos on here I've got to pull and upload. All right, folks, that is all for this workout. Thanks for joining me. Hope you got something out of it. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.